Do you identify allopatric versus sympatric speciation? Remember that the difference here is that allopatric speciation occurs when there's a geological barrier and sympatric there's no geological barrier. You can see in our first example, the species of trees has been divided by a mountain. And after many generations, it separates into two distinct species. So what type of speciation is this? This is an example of allopatric speciation. In our second example, you start with a species of white butterflies. Within the same environment, one group of the butterflies become darker and speciate into a different species, eventually after many generations becoming two distinct species. So what type of speciation is this? This is an example of sympatric speciation since there wasn't a geographical barrier. All right, here's our next one. You can see the original species of trees divide into two separate species within the same environment. So what type of speciation is this? This is another example of sympatric speciation. And our last one, you can see the original color of species was divided by a river, and after many generations there are two distinct species. So this is an example of allopatric speciation.